which one of these should you use to clean your baby umbilical cord? Your boy Keen. And it's your girl T. And we're back, back with, with another, another video. video. Yes, guys. We're back with another video, man. You know what I mean? Hope y'all miss us though. You know what yes. I mean? So obviously you guys know this is a new year. New year. So that means new vibes. Obviously, for 2022. We just want to say thank you for everyone that's been with us since 2021. Last year was an amazing year, and this year is going to be even more Bad. amazing. Yep, yep. Um, if you haven't watched our recap of 2021, go watch it. Maybe above, I want to say, you know what I mean? We got everybody got their New Year's resolution, and everybody's sticking to it, and you're going to stick to it the whole year. Yes. You know what I mean? And also, we just want to say that everyone is healthy and good out there, man. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Health is wealth, man. So just make sure you guys are healthy. And stay so before we get into this video, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, welcome, 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 join the TK gang, and leave a comment. All right, let's get right into this video. Today we are doing questions like you're gonna see if you know how to take care of a baby. So yeah. questions so today to we're yeah. quizzing me, um, and seeing if I am ready yeah, we, to you be know, a parent. Ready, you know, ready. And our first question: How many times do you feed a baby? One hour one on every hour or three meals a day or eight to ten times let me show you i'm trying to look on my sheet okay sheet. um i'm gonna say eight to ten times why huh why why yeah um because you need it has to be like every two hours i'm pretty sure Every two hours you feed the newborn. Uh -huh. Or something like that, yeah. Alright. What's the number one never leave home without an item you should bring for in for an afternoon at the park with your six month old? So there's one item that you never leave without. A diaper, the video camera, or a burp cloth. Diaper. That's easy. Yeah, that was easy. Alright, <laughs> All right, let's go. All right. How long should you let your newborn cry before responding? Uh pick him up right away instead of letting them cry. Ten to fifteen minutes until they stop. Dang this one. Um I think it varies, but Yeah, because some people got stop? like that. Oh no, 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 no. no. Oh, you gonna let you gonna let her cry till you no, start? You no, wrong, no, 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 bro. Not until it stops. You wrong, man. man. You're, no, you wait. Say, say the most tricks again. It was pick up right away instead of letting them cry. Ten to fifteen minutes oh, until yeah, he stops. Oh yeah, pick up right away. Like if she starts crying, I'm yeah. But then sometimes when you do that, the baby become a cry baby, and then it's like every time they cry, you gotta pick him up. So it's kind of like, it's kind of like, <laughs> I don't know. But that answer, yeah, that answer if it was right. A, with a newborn. <clears throat> Though, babe, they don't know. Like, okay, if they're older and you cry, oh, yeah, yeah, and they right. cry for, oh, they want a toy or they want candy, okay, that yeah, you're makes right, you're sense. Right, you're right, you're right, you're right. But you're if right. the newborn, right. it's like. He got one. He got What's the standard advice on how long after childbirth you should wait until you and your partner can have sex again? Six weeks, one week, oh, six, six weeks. months. Six weeks. How you know? Because I, I, on TikTok, I see everyone say six weeks. They go, wait, six weeks. <laughs> All right, you got that one. All right, yeah, when can you start reading to your baby? Anytime. Right away, it's never too soon. When he can sit up on it on his own, or four to six months. Oh, it's never too soon. I think. Um. Yeah. Yeah, because you can you can read anytime. You know these months. You, you, you know these months gonna ask beforehand, huh? Which one 
of these should you use to clean your baby umbilical cord? Nothing, nothing is best to leave it alone. Soap and water or baby shampoo? Nothing. Um, yeah. Safest place in the car for the newborn baby to ride. In an infant car seat facing oh, yeah. backwards. In the front seat. In an infant car seat facing backwards. In the back seat. Or on someone's lap in the back seat. The second one. Hmm? The second one. The infant car in the back seat facing in the back. You know these answers. Uh, you memorize these answers. What's the safest position for babies to sleep? On the back, on the side, or on the tummy? On the back. All right, yep, you got all one. And that seems like all the questions. So I got, I was good. Yeah, seems like right. Really so this is the end of the video. Just wanna say we hope you guys enjoy the rest of the week, you know what I mean? And you guys enjoy your weekend. And we will see you guys next week with yes. some new videos and new vibes, new energy, all that, and all the good stuff. Yes. But yeah, man, make sure you guys um, safe out there. Make and sure to put the bell so you guys are notified every time we do post a video. Yeah, for that part. This year, um, baby girl is supposed to be coming next month, so we yeah. are super excited. And also, our baby shower is coming up soon, too. So, we will have a video of that so you guys will be able to see and feel like you guys were there and be a part of that. But until then, make sure you go ahead and subscribe right now if yes. you haven't already subscribed. And, yeah, we want to thank you guys for the support. And we'll see you guys in the next video. You did. Yeah. All the places you are going.